High blood pressure, also called hypertension, is when the pressure in your blood vessels is unusually high. In this video we'll provide several useful tips on how to lower your blood pressure naturally. Worldwide there's an estimated 75 million people who, suffer from hypertension or high blood pressure. These individuals take on average 1 to 3 medication daily which we know has a long list of side effects. Number 1 A change of diet. One of the best diets to aid with help with high blood pressure is the ketogenic diet. A diet high in fat and low in carbohydrates, sugars, that causes the body to break down fat into molecules called ketones. Research has shown that by reducing the intake of carbohydrates, and having better control over insulin sensitivity, your body reacts in a positive manner, ultimately lowering your blood pressure. The ketogenic diet is effect because it lowers insulin level to a low normal level, which is going to reverse hypertension or high blood pressure. Number 2 Increase your magnesium and potassium intake. Magnesium plays many crucial roles in the body, such as supporting muscle and nerve function and producing energy. Low magnesium levels usually don't cause symptoms. However, Chronically low levels can increase the risk of high blood pressure. On the ketogenic diet mentioned earlier which highly promotes the consumption of dark leafy greens, rich protein meats, a wide variety of nuts, that have a good supply of magnesium. In several medical institutions across the United States, researches were carried out, confirming that when your potassium levels are optimal, your blood pressure is lower. Number 3 Get a good night's sleep. Sleep deprivation it's going make your blood pressure higher. Sleep apnea is one of the leading causes of secondary hypertension in America today. Sleep apnea is a potentially serious sleep disorder in which breathing repeatedly stops and starts. And that's just one of the ways that getting poor sleep can raise your blood pressure. Why? If you're not getting enough sleep then your adrenaline levels are going to chronically be higher. Your cortisol levels, as well as your insulin levels, because your body is still active. So you see a good night's rest is essential for lowering your blood pressure. Number 4 Avoid alcohol. As a young adult it's okay to have a few drinks every now and again when you don't have blood pressure problems. But as we get older and take on life journey alcohol is no longer considered a friend especially if you're on medications for your blood pressure, then you need to seize this habit immediately. Alcohol can make some medications less effective by interfering with absorption process inside your digestive tract. In some case alcohol is known to increase the bioavailability of the drug causing the concentration of the drug to increase causing toxicity in the bloodstream. So for a hypertensive person or someone with high blood pressure this can be a deadly combination. Number 5 Regular Exercise Regular exercise makes the heart stronger. A stronger heart can pump more blood with less effort. As a result the force on the arteries decrease gradually. Which ultimately lowers blood pressure levels naturally. No you don't need to go outside and run a marathon. Any simple cardio exercise to increase blood flow is good. Having high blood pressure is no excuse not to be inactive especially when it poses to be more beneficial than harmful. Number 6 Constant Monitoring If you have been diagnosed with hypertension or high blood pressure, it's solely your responsibility to ensure that you have the necessary tools required to keep a close watch and not have this fluctuating. You should be checking your blood pressure at least 2 to 3 days daily and as such. You should own a blood pressure monitor. Please be mindful that it is possible for doctors to mistakenly place you on a blood pressure medicine based on that one blood pressure reading. This should never be the case so use your machine regularly and make notes. If you notice that if your blood pressure is consistently high then you consult your doctor as you might need a temporary medicine to get that blood pressure under control. In summary while there is no cure for high blood pressure. However lifestyle changes like eating a healthy diet. 
and exercising regularly can help lower high blood pressure. If you like the video give us a thumbs up and share it with your friends. Write your opinion in our comments section and don't forget to subscribe. Turn on the notification bell to receive all new videos. Thanks for watching until next time.